Hey guys. Hey, I'm going to do another quick video. Uh, this has to do with, um, uh, you know, sometimes you want a um, polyline sleeve, uh, you know, instead of just a paper sleeve. Uh, and uh, sometimes you don't have one. Well, I um, I picked up a, um, a record from a Japanese dealer um, off of Discogs not too long ago. And this Japanese dealer was a wonderful guy because, or woman or whoever it was, whatever organization it was, they sent me a whole bunch of these, uh, those Japanese type sleeves. Here, they look like this, okay? And he sent me a whole bunch, like maybe a dozen, all right? I've already used three and lined some... Um, paper sleeves, a couple of Who albums that I got. Uh, right now, I'm actually doing uh, three more. I just did one, and I'm going to do two more, and I thought, well, let me just show how I do this using Elmer's glue and just the original paper sleeves that I have. What I do is I just... Uh, I had to cut the corners off of these because the corners are cut off of the um, the paper inner sleeve that I have here, see? Okay, and I picked up this, this Bowie 3 LP set, live in Japan, 1990, and no line sleeves, so, so I'm gonna show you what I do. All right, let me put this in here, and let's, um, Here, I, I should have set this up before I started shooting, but it just occurred to me to do it. And so, uh, all right, all right. And let's just put this down here so you can see what's going here. Let's do it like I did last time. I'll put it over here so you can see what the heck I'm doing. And Bowie's staring at me like I'm important or something. Give me a break. All right, so, um, all right, there you go. You see? All right, here's, I'll show you what I do. I already cut the corners off of these things. So that when they slip in here, it doesn't look too odd with the corner sticking out. You don't need that corner section anyway. So what I'm doing is just slipping the damn thing, the paper rice sleeve or whatever this is, polyline sleeve or whatever it is, I'm slipping it in here. Okay, see? See, it's in there now. You see? window here right and this is all I do <clears throat> there the cow again right I think it's actually a horse but maybe I shouldn't maybe that's a bad joke maybe I shouldn't go there oh, sorry I apologize to those who might be offended by that bad joke all right, um, it's Elmer's glue. I don't think it's made from a horse. All right, so anyway, here's all I do, man. Pick it up. Make sure that you're not doing it, that you don't have the polyline sleeve, right? And then you just go, got a little glue on here. Squeeze it out. Just go like this. That's it. Okay. And then try to flatten it out. And then I press this down. You're going to see it wrinkle where the glue is. Right there. But who cares? I don't care about these wrinkles. Right? 
Now I'm flipping it over. And I'm doing this side real quick and easy. Whoa, shit. Whoa. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. So I'll do that. Oh, boy. See? You even get to see the mistakes. <laughs> yeah, but it's no big deal. It ain't a big deal, man. You just go like that. Remember this? Part of the, it's part of the kit. You know, you, get, you have to, sometimes you got to wipe the glue off. So... <clears throat> Maybe I was taking a chance by doing it right on top of the of the album cover, but I don't think so. I didn't get any glue on here. Now what you know what happens? See? Polyline sleeve opens right up. What do they say on all those goofy commercials? No fuss, no muss, right? Really, there is no issue here. This is done. Uh, I put my album. This is record two. All right, because I already did one. So I slip my album in here. And... Uh, Open this up. Record two goes there. Let's pull out record three. Because I didn't do this one yet. I need a really, I, I need a real table. That's one thing I need here. You know, so apartment living, you know, sometimes you, uh, Sometimes you run out of room. Some things. These trifold uh, packages, they are a little bit of a problem. It's not that big a deal. All right, so. One more time. There it is. You slide it into place. It's so, I make it look simple because it is that simple, okay? All right, you can see it's in there. I just like to make sure that it's in position and it's uh it's not crooked or anything yep it's good to go one more time This Japanese dealer, I picked up a Todd, I picked up a Utopia album. This Japanese dealer had an Australian copy of a red vinyl um, Utopia album, an Australian pressing of what the Road to Utopia, I think it is. Or is that the title song? Adventure, Adventures in Utopia, that's the one. And, um, oh yeah. 
So, um, and uh, I picked that up. Uh, but the guy, wh whoever this was, was so nice. He sent me, like I said, like a dozen of these, of these like rice paper things or whatever they are. And um, voila. So this is really cool uh, because I, um, I picked up this Bowie album just about a week ago. And um, it's trifold. Ay, ay, ay. I need a real table. <laughs> Something that's just a little bit bigger. But anyway, uh, that's it. I just took care of that whole problem. And now I have three polyline sleeves, inner sleeves for my Bowie album here. So, uh, so there you go, man. That's I just wanted to show how easy that is. Now, the big question is, where do you get those polyline sleeves from? Those Japanese sleeves? Uh, can you order them from some dealer in Japan? I don't know. The guy surprised me when uh, when he sent those along with my uh, album. All right, so so I was fortunate enough to fortunate enough to come on, stupid right there. I was fortunate enough to get all these um, these Japanese polyline sleeves. All right, so there you go. That easy. That's all you do. That's you're over here. That is all you do. All right, so there you go. I don't need to do a, a before and after because I'm done. And I did that in what, maybe 10 minutes. All right, I'm gonna do a video. I'm gonna redo my update to my Foo Fighters uh, records, uh, seven inch records, uh, because I omitted a few. <laughs> I can't believe I screwed up. So I'm gonna do it over and then um, I might do one uh, uh, white stripes a feature on my White Stripes collection. I like the White Stripes. I like Jack and Meg. I think they make a really great sound. So, uh, I do have some, uh, I have a White Stripes music collection that is pretty damn good. And um, maybe I'll do that too tonight. So I might do three videos. This one, and then two, uh, the Foo Fighters update, re-update, and then uh, White Stripes. All right, uh, I hope this was helpful to anybody who wants to uh, um, do what I did. <laughs> okay, man, I'm, I'm shaking like, uh, whoa, whoa, <laughs> too much fun. All right, see ya, bye.